Bethany. Thank you so much for checking back with the pod this week. We are going to go into our weekly devotion and we are going to be in the book of Psalm. Uh, we are going to be 17, Psalm 17 verse 6. This is a scripture that I actually uh, prayed over. I fasted over this uh, particular verse. It is something that I implemented uh, in my beginning prayer life with the Lord because it was something that I didn't understand. Uh, a lot of times whenever we pray about things, sometimes we're wanting that immediate answer. God doesn't always answer immediately. Sometimes he doesn't answer at all, but that's not him saying no. That's not him saying uh, it's not going to happen for you. Sometimes it's just a not right now. Sometimes, uh, like I said last week on the pod, that sometimes it, he's wanting to tell us something, but we're just yet can't grasp the wisdom that he's going to put, put on us. And sometimes it's just... It just happens and silence I always say silence also speaks volume so you just have to wait you have to be patient but leaning on this scripture and trusting him and having that confidence that all of our prayers are answered um, it's just in his will in his way in his time and we have to be patient and we have to be understanding but that is where our maturity within our relationship comes with him we also have to believe that uh, that having confidence in our prayers with him and going to him boldly is also a thing that he urges for us he wants us to be bold whenever we speak to him he wants us to have confidence and our confidence within ourselves actually roots from him and we have to have confidence within him so that we have confidence in the words that we speak and so the verse is psalm 17 6 and it says i call on you my god you will answer me Turn your ear to me and hear my prayer. If you have your Bible, I would love for you to underline, highlight this verse, especially where it says right there in the second part, for you will answer me. Yes, he will. Like I said, sometimes it, you get an immediate answer. Sometimes you get a not right now. Sometimes you don't get an answer at all, but that's still him answering. And you have to have faith that your prayer will be heard. He is listening. Uh, I was sharing with someone uh, last week that whenever we went to youth camp with our students last year, we were in a room full of all of the adults and the um, youth pastor there who was running it wanted us to all say our prayers out loud. Okay, mind you, there is 20, 30, maybe 35 people in this room and we are all sitting in a circle. And at one time we begin to pray and at first it was a distraction for me, but then I kind of sat back and sat in awe because I could hear all of these things that everyone was just releasing and surrendering over and trusting that the Lord was hearing every single one of us in that moment. And I was just kind of like, man, God, you this is what you hear all the time? Like, it was just crazy to hear it in that moment, but it was such a beautiful way to express that he hears all of us each specific one even though there was 30 35 people in that room i know he specifically heard each one of us individually and you have to believe that you have to trust that and you have to know that um with confidence again that word just keeps coming back up that you can be assured that he is going to see you through your prayers that he is going to guide you he may even bring someone uh to intercede in a sense to be a vessel of something that you need to hear um and then next week we're going to talk about the holy spirit and how the holy spirit intercedes for us that whenever we don't have words to say or we don't know what we're saying the holy spirit kind of takes that for us so uh, make sure that you like and subscribe to this channel make sure you like this video share it with a friend share it with a sister uh, if you are listening to it on the pod make sure that you take a moment whatever platform that you're watching on and rate the show give me a good comment uh, if you need to reach out to me, if you need specific prayer, if there's something you want to hear on the pod, give me a shout out. Uh, shoot me an email at bethany at unleashedfaith.com. You can also check out the website at unleashedfaith.com. As always, be blessed and stay focused.